Welcome back, everybody. Let's take a quick look at our time lapse over the last six hours. You'll see some of those clouds kind of, most of them are thin in the higher levels there, and then we're getting some little lower level clouds coming through this late morning, early afternoon hours right now. Currently, we do have temperatures sitting at 87 degrees. Humidity is at about 41%, so it is going to feel a little bit muggy out there. Winds are fairly light from the south at about 7 miles an hour. Looking around the rest of the region, we've got a lot of mid to upper 80s at the moment, so we're going to continue to elevate those temperatures as we get through the day. Now we do have a bit of an interesting, we do have a severe drought kind of going on in most of Crockett County and a little bit over into Sutton County right now. So we are hitting that next level of drought, but for a majority of it, Contra Valley, we are sitting in the abnormal area with a little bit into a moderate drought for some counties. And as we continue getting through our day, we'll have some of those clouds kind of pushing up from the west, and they're going to be moving in a northeast direction going through. We do have some showers off the eastern portion of Texas going into Louisiana, especially around the edge of the coast here. But this next one here, you'll notice that we have a little bit more brown kind of coming through in the Gulf, and that is the first wave of the Saharan dust storm that has made its way across the Atlantic. So it is covering a majority of the Gulf right now, and that is going to eventually be making its way into our area. Not quite as much as what you see in the peninsula here. And then moving over to the Atlantic, this is a second wave that is going to be making its way into our area as we get into possibly later next week. So it's just going to lower the air quality as we continue getting through with that. And then mostly sunny skies throughout the afternoon hours. We're going to start picking up later on the afternoon, southeast 10 to 15 miles per hour gusts up to 20 can be expected and highs around the region will be in the 90s so you got some lower 90s and the mid 90s on the eastern half and then we're getting into the upper 90s as we go westward now tonight we are going to be dropping to just 71 degrees mostly clear skies winds are going to calm down 5 to 10 miles per hour and then pick back up up to 15 miles per hour tomorrow 97 degrees for a high with partly cloudy skies so overall not too bad we will have that mix of sun and clouds as we get through our day tomorrow and then a little bit more cloud as we get into Saturday morning into the afternoon hours as well. We're not expecting any precipitation until possibly Sunday, even Monday afternoon. Mostly cloudy skies on Sunday. And then we will start to see those temperatures getting back into the triple digits as we start off into next week. Coming up after the break, we will have Lita Boatman back from Cruise Planners. You're watching KLST News at Noon. We'll be right back.